Listen. You hear it, right? Sounds like a woman's voice. What do we hit? Hell if I know. I can't see a damn thing. Berto, hold the wheel steady. Greg! Who the hell are you people? Rando! Looks like you caught our thieves. Nice job. You know, every person we find living, they got some dead with them. Who was it for you, I wonder? your keep. Stop! So... Oh, God. You fucking shot him! I didn't mean to! Do you think that matters? <laughs> screwed up. Randall should be the one laying there. Not your brother. I can't undo what I did, but maybe I can help. I owe you. Both of you. You want to help? Start by getting us the fuck out of here. Not going to be easy, but I'll do what I can. Is, is he still breathing? <laughs> Jonas! I thought you'd have more time. What, what, what do you mean? Oh, no. Jonas, listen. I, I, I said I'd help them escape. Then we need to disappear, too. Yeah. Okay. Let's find Pete and get the hell off this boat. Thanks, Michonne, for stopping me. As much as I wanted to, for what he did. I'm glad I didn't kill Zachary. Killing Zachary wasn't the answer here, and it wouldn't have made you feel any better. I, I, I know. Joe, can you give me a hand with something? I couldn't get anything out of him. Zachary was useless. Oh, these people just aren't talking. Yeah. Problem is, we still know nothing about him. I'll get him to talk. Don't worry. I have to worry. After last time... It won't go down like that. I swear. It can't. They see me gone, 
You haven't got a chance of getting out of here. Hey, Randall! You want to tell me how this happened? Zachary! He was guarding the door. Right. Samantha put you up to this? Where is she? Come on. Out with it. Where is she? Probably headed for shore. I doubt she got far. Norma, forget about the girl. We can figure this out between us. I'd like that, Pete. But your friend here seems to have other ideas. Randall, sound the horn. Sure thing. Drop the machete. I said drop it. I said drop it while you still have it. <laughs> <laughs> Figure it out. Michonne? I'll see if I can find us a ride out of here. Out if we have to, then we're us. No, we are not killing people. I'll give myself up. Wait. It buys you time to escape and no one dies. And I'll find a way back to you. I can reason with these people. That'll never work. I'd rather not fight these people, but I'm not sure we'll have a choice. You start butchering their people, and our chances of making it out of here, any of us, go down to zero. I'm doing what's best for my crew. That includes you. Run! We gotta stop him! Now! Show no! What are you doing? I could've talked them down. I'm not taking any chances. Get ready. Up. 
You've already stolen our shit. You're not taking our boat, too. You should look behind you. <laughs> you think I'd fall for that shit? It didn't have to happen this way. You gotta learn to keep your machete on your back, instead of hack your way out. You're crazy if you think Norman listened to you. I think she would have done anything to avoid that. All I'm saying is next time, let me do what I do first. And if that doesn't work, your machete can do the talk. There's no way we can get back to our boat. We can hide out at my house until it's clear. My dad can help you. It's not far. We'll get there before morning. He can really help us. He's the smartest guy I know. He's got a temper, but I can vouch for you. distance between us and Norma. Hope the walkers go for them instead. We can lose them in the woods. How are we gonna do that? Yeah, it's not like we're just gonna walk through those things. Stay close. Stay quiet as long as you can. 
long as we don't bump into any of them, we'll be fine. That worked. Just be glad it did. Take him down. Into the woods. Move. The crew's gonna have to wait. We'll circle back when things cool off. Better not take long. Don't like the thought of Oak left unsupervised. There's a shortcut to my house. But you're not gonna like it. It's not as bad as it looks. I know the way up. This'll work. How are we supposed to climb this? Carefully. If we survive this, I won't complain about going up the rigging anymore. Craig and I climbed it one by one. But I don't think we have time for that. Follow my lead. Some fucking shortcut. Just move. Randall, I found him! This way! Go! Shit!
Norma's place a while back when it was just a couple of boats anchored to a pier. They had some supplies just sitting out and Norma caught me. I didn't think she was going to, but she, she, she let me go. And, and now Greg is dead. Don't beat yourself up, Sam. We all make mistakes. Move on. Why'd she let you go? She took pity on me. I told her my family was starving, and, and that was enough. It's like you used up all the pity she's got. This last time, I thought we could just hide this stuff on the ferry. But Greg, he, he didn't think it was safe. I, I should have... Listen. God, I'm, I'm dizzy. Thanks. A clear path. You're not looking so good. I feel even worse. Talking helps. I... I don't want to black out on you. Stay with us, Sam. You sure your house is safe? I think so. It's kept us alive for the past... Oh, however long it's been. It's hard to find. That's our only real defense, though. We've been lucky. Right now, I'll take whatever we can get. Yeah. I got this one. Stick close. It, it's too dangerous out here. Dad was right. He said none of us should leave the house. Walkers are trouble. People are worse. I didn't listen. It wasn't your fault. What happened to Greg? Huh. That's not what he's gonna think. We'll help him understand, Sam. Sometimes you can't make good out of a bad situation. I, I don't know. How am I supposed to tell my dad about Greg? It's gonna ruin him. I don't know if I can. Let me handle it. I'll tell him. Thanks, Michonne. Sam. Sam. Sam, wake up. Can't catch a goddamn break.
Almost there, Sam. Almost home. Uh, oh. Don't fucking move! Not one more step! Whoa, 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 whoa! We're not gonna hurt you. We just wanna help this girl. Sam! Is she dead? Did you kill her? Answer me or I'll shoot! I'm not fucking around! Sam's still alive, but she won't be for long unless you let us in. <coughs> Michonne. Sam? Maybe you shot her. Or you. Maybe you'll come in here and kill everyone. I can't take that risk. So just put Sam down and leave. The longer you talk, the more blood she loses. God damn it. Ugh, fine, get her in here. What's your name? It, it, it's James. Okay, James. You got a first aid kit? K kind of. Get it. Fast. Whatever we're gonna do, we gotta do it fast. doing with that Sam Sam I got you I'm here uh, I need to clean the wound uh, Sam uh, is the bullet still in there didn't punch through we gotta we gotta get it out right there's too much blood Use this. I'll hold her down. This is gonna really fucking hurt. Hold her down! You two! We got her. No! Oh my god! No, 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 no! Get away from her! John! What are you doing to my daughter? Saving her life. With that? Let me do this. I've almost got the wound closed. James, let me.
Is she going to make it? I can't lose her. I can't. My poor Samantha. The bleeding stopped. That's what matters. Tell me. What happened? You appear out of nowhere? With my daughter nearly bleeding to death? That bullet was supposed to hit me. Got Sam instead. Then it should be you lying on this table. Look at me. I don't know who the hell you are, but... Dad! Dad? Where's Greg? Greg... didn't make it? No. It's okay, boys. It's okay. Colette? Elodie? You girls in here? Girls? You in here?
this all behind? Was he taking the girls? Here. To my place. Outside the city. Thought it'd be safer. But they should have been here. Hours ago. We have to find them. They could be anywhere. And if we can't get a hold of them, I... I don't... Where do we... Stay where you are. I'm coming to you. Hey, what are you... No, no, please, please, no. talking to you. Did did you say Donna? You okay? Do that sometimes. <laughs> hey, I get that. These days we're all a bit off. John, he he went to talk to the kids, make sure they're all right. While I watched over you. Sorry about this. John isn't big on people he doesn't know. What's that for? Rabbits, mostly. Possum once in a while, if we get lucky. Possum actually tastes decent, if you cook it right. So, yeah. This is where I apologize for almost shooting you. Emphasis on almost. I was just worried. Don't worry about it. it. Happens more often than I like to admit. If it makes you feel any better, I'm not a great shot. That patch of dirt, his mom's buried there. A year or so back, she just She was sick. Not in the head. Something with her heart. She couldn't handle it, I guess. I never understood that. Those poor children. John told them she died in her sleep. Tried to spare them. Not that it helped much. If it wasn't for Sam... No. Oh. Oh, Greg. I just need more time. More. No. No. I'm here, Sam. 
Hey, don't move, okay? Don't move. <sighs> Sam, no. <sighs> Mission, we have to help him. You're too weak. Move me up. Just stay down, Sam. Sam, Greg is dead. No, Greg. <sighs> Sam. I know John can make a strong first impression, but he's what's keeping this entire family from being buried out there. You gotta fight like hell for what you care about, right? Something that makes all this shit worth it. What's that for you? My parents had me, but never seemed to want me around. Sam, though, she, she always did. God, I hated her guts when I first met her. She used to pick on me all the time. Thought she was tough shit. Little did she know, I was tough shit too. You'd be crazy to stay here, John. This woman normally Enough. will... There's no decision to be made on this. I need a word with you. In private. children a son I do two little girls <sighs> it snowed the day my wife died Her heart gave out. Sam found her. She... She passed in her sleep. We buried her so the boys wouldn't have to see her like that. The snow... It covered her grave. We erased it. Like she'd never been there at all. Paige said she killed herself. I... I didn't want my children to think of their mother differently. I wonder why she given up. Ever since Sophia, I've tried to keep our family from harm. But we're falling apart, piece by piece. And now that Sam's hurt, and Craig's... I could really use your help. Your friend Pete told me all about Norma. About what happened. If she finds us, we wouldn't stand a chance. But you seem like someone who can hold their own. Sam said you could help me. If you do that, I'll give you guys a hand. Anything. Whatever you need. <sighs> Children shouldn't have to see this. Greg never turned into one of these things, did he? Are those... Whatever they are. He's at peace now. Thank God. I... I'm sorry. I'm trying to keep it together. 
But what if you just found out your daughters were dead? And you weren't there. You were miles away, safe and sound. How would you feel? There would be nothing else worth living for. What's left of my family? That's what I'm living for. Peekaboo. Dead yet. Uh, uh, you? Yourself, huh? Caught yourself a golden goose. I'm asking the questions here. Say now, won't this be fun? That's up to you. <clears throat> Does Norma know we're here? She doesn't even know I'm here. Otherwise, you'd be hearing an able knock on your door right about now. Randall? Randall, are you getting this? You, uh, 
Wanna get that for me? We heard gunshots. If you don't check in, I'm sending everyone in that direction. Shit. She sounds pissed. Randall, pick up, goddammit. You gonna answer? Talk to her, Michonne. Don't make the same mistake again. You heard her. Randall needs to check in. You know, this feels mighty familiar. Except you're there. And I'm here. So, Miss Schoen, what do you want me to say to her? On account of me hoping to avoid more broken fingers, your wish is my command. Call off your sister, or I break every bone in your hand. I'll play nice. Hey, Norma. Randall, are you all right? Yeah, I'm all right. But Miss Schoen here is mighty upset. She wants me to... Hey! I wasn't finished yet. I was doing what you said, Michonne. Randall? I lost you. Have a girl, huh? No more know something's wrong soon enough. And if I can find you, she'll find you. You know, this alone time, you and me together, it's been real nice. But that all ends when my sister gets here. I'm gonna take that wrench and break your skull. Then Sam's and yours. Last but not least, those kitties, too. I saw their little heads in the window. Kids, you know, their skulls don't break so much as kind of melt. I hit a button. Michonne. Well, hey now. Don't you two look like your daddy? Back when he still had a face. <laughs> what? Yeah. Got a big hole there now. Michonne. Is that true? Please tell me he's fucking with us. Randall murdered your dad, Sam. No! No. No. James! If he killed my dad, then why isn't this son of a bitch dead? First good question asked all night. Jones just been fumbling around like a bear cub fucking a football. He keeps opening his mouth. He'll be dead soon. We should do it right fucking now. All she wants is her brother back. That's it. We're out of the equation. You need to kill him, or I will. Sam, wait! No matter what I say, you're just gonna do whatever you want anyway. I know you've already made up your mind. Well, <laughs> I ain't had the battle of the ball. Well, maybe that's you. Because when this dance is over, you're fucked. Kill me, and Norma hunts you down until you're all dead. Fucked! Let me live, then I do even worse. Fucked. But we both know how this is gonna end, Michonne. You like killing. Then you'd like killing me, wouldn't you? Just tell old Randall the truth. I got thick skin. You're right about that. Feels good to get that out in the open, don't it? Or well, maybe.
Maybe you think you can rise above all that. But there ain't no heaven up there, honey. And there ain't no hell down below. There's only this shit every day until you die. And you know what's the fucking kicker? You get up and keep walking. That's how it is now. Nothing we can do to change it. Preaching in the fucking choir. This is the world your kids are dying in, Michelle. <gasps> or dying in. Or are in that fucking purgatory. Shut up. Don't talk about them. By the way, they're suffering. And mommy isn't there. We all have our demons, honey. Some are on the inside. Some are sitting right in front of us. I spent a lot of time in low, low places. Where you only have your thoughts for company. And those can be mean, nasty. You want to believe all lives and all deaths have a purpose. Believe me, they don't. It's true. Things always fall apart. But we're the ones who bring them down. 